welcome to TreeTuber. In this video, I will show you how to use dollar function in Excel. It is the most helpful function available in Excel and most easiest also. Let us see an example of using a dollar function. There is a function that y equal to xyz, x is constant 5 and z is variable as you see uh, the value of z is 1 to 10 and y equal to xyz. If we don't know the dollar function then we have to put a column of x here and we have to write the function uh, the value of x as 5 in each row now ha we have to write the formula as equal to y equal to x sorry this is x not x z uh, we have to write y equal to x cross z enter and if we drag down then uh, you can see we get our expected result but in this case we have to write the value of x in every row so now I, I uh, now I am showing the using of dollar dollar is a function that makes a cell row or column as constant right equals to x into z put this x as this is constant the row and column that is the cell is constant so we have to make the column and row both constant the shortcut key of dollar is f4 press f4 you can see the changes it see the dollar c, dollar c dollar 4 that means the column and row that that is uh, the cell gets constant if you press f4 again you can see that c dollar 4 that is the row the column is uh, row uh, column is variable but the row is constant if you see uh, press again dollar f4 so dollar c4 it means the column gets constant but the row is not constant it is variable so, uh, here our expected form is dollar c dollar 4 that is the sale is constant cross z z uh, is not constant so don't need to put the dollar sign then just enter if you drag it you get, get the same result and see any for checking of any formula you uh, double click and then see that the dollar c dollar 4 gets constant let's see another example here is the example there is a variable z uh, from 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 it is written in the row wise and the x is written in column so how we have we have to write just one cell formula in one cell and you can drag it is towards right and towards bottom so uh, using uh, if we do not write if we do not write the dollar function then we have to write at least five formulas either in column or in row but using dollar we just minimize to write the number of functions see we write here y equal to x cross z but you can see if we drag it right this, this cell also get shifted in the right or direction so we have to fixed its its column 
not row because when you drag in downward direction it should move so so we press f10 and you can see dollar h 10 that is this column gets fixed so it is right cross this cell if we drag down then it should move in this direction so we don't we need not constant the column we need to constant this row 7 so press f4 again f4 that you can see that i dollar 7 that is the row number gets fixed enter so we just need to write down one formula and if we drag it towards right and then drag it towards down then you s get all the form all the results by just writing one formula this is how helpful the dollar function is hope you liked this video if you uh, enjoyed it please like and subscribe thank you true tuber